Hi everyone, Sean with Jaspies, CaseBreaks.com here doing 2021 Hit Parade Baseball Limited Edition Series 15 Hobby 10 box case break random team number one, where obviously all cards ship, and it's one of the best repack products there is. So, 2021 Hit Parade Baseball Limited Edition Series 15 Hobby 10 box case out of 100, Jeter, DeGrom, Tatis, etc. 30 spots, everyone gets a random team in LBB, and one card per box. Every box in here, so there's 10 cases made each hand numbered and inside those are randomly inserted 10 of these boxes which are also hand numbered to 100. We have two cases here. So random team number two is already in the store. We're going to figure out which case we're going to do for random team one. Second one, whichever one we don't hit with the dice, we'll actually end up with random team number two which is in the store now. Go get your spots. Here is the list of customers for the first iteration. Robert Flores down to Jeremy Port and last spot mojo and Washington Nationals back up to the Arizona Diamondbacks. Dice roll to randomize both lists and pair them up three and a four seven times. Uh, lower, Will. Lower. VIP is higher. Their, their higher end ones are VIP and Sapphire. VIP, I think, is their highest one. Seven times in the randomizer, seven times in the dice. It's still really cool stuff. I mean, Hit Parade I, doesn't do bad repacks, luckily. Seven spots. Seven dice. That's why Jaspies loves Hit Parade. One. Two. And I also got some pretty comfortable sweat, uh, sweater from them as well. From the Cardinals down to the Reds. Seven times. Seven times on the dice. So, Kyle Samuel with the Cardinals, Steve Birch with the Red Sox, Kurt Bros with the Brewers, Jeremy Razor with the Orioles, uh, Corey Parson with the Dodgers, Wade Valentine with the Rays, Jeremy Port with the A's, Kurt Bros with the Cubs, Victor Zamora with the White Sox, Corey Parson with the Blue Jays, Kurt Bros with the Mariners, Howard Tongue with the Rangers, Robert Flores with the Nationals, Jeremy Rezor with the Diamondbacks, Jeff Goldhaber with the Padres, Jeremy Rezor with the Indians, Oliver Soria with the Braves, Chris Miller with the Angels, Robert Flores with the Phillies, John Gotti with the Twins, Steve Birch with the Royals, Robert Flores with the Marlins, Corey Parson with the Rockies, Robert Flores with the Yankees and the Mets, Jeremy Port with the Tigers, Kurt Bros with the Astros, Robert Flores with the Pirates, John Gotti with the Giants, and Robert Flores with the Reds. Trade window is open. Be careful. There is no type of checklist with a product like this. So, understand when you are trading, it's pretty much blind. There you go. So, there is your list. Uh, we're going to pop over here real quick while you trade window is open. Here are the cases. Uh, we have two cases. One's going to be for this break. One's going to be for uh, number two. This is case number four out of ten. And this is six out of ten. One, two, three on the dice for case four on the left. Four, five, six on the dice for case six on the right. Three. So we're going to go with case four. Case number six will be for random team number two, which is in the store. 30 spots. Go get them. Uh, if there's no talks of trades, I guess we'll just go ahead and uh, print and rip. Kick back over to the list if anybody wants. There's the case, obviously. Not doing anything with it. No funky business. Oh, and if you didn't notice, this giant box back here, that's Tops Transcendent. It's in the store. We're about halfway gone on there. We need spots taken straight up, and we need to do some fillers. Go get your spots, guys. Let's do it tonight. So there's literally nobody talking about trades. So let's go ahead and print and rip. Everybody's happy with the teams they got. So here is case number four. Like I said, they make ten cases total, each one hand-numbered. And then inside of those, they randomly insert... 10 of their boxes. And each one of those is hand numbered as well. Platinum Sapphire. 
fire VIP. I, be, I think you're right, Mike. I think that's exactly how it goes. I don't know though. Sapphire, I, I, Sapphire might be higher, Mike, just because I think with Sapphire, they only do, uh, of course, Hank, no problem. Um, I think Sapphire only has like three hits in a case, doesn't it? So maybe it's like dollar for dollar it's higher because you're only getting three hits. I think, I don't know, I could be wrong. But one thing is for sure, it doesn't matter if it's limited, platinum, sapphire, or VIP. Hit parade does it right. Cool. So first box we've got is 74 out of 100. Let me grab my list here. You'll see these, uh, if anybody's never, if you haven't seen any of the Hit Parade products that we've done before, uh, all the packaging is exceptional. Each one's individually plastic wrapped. Then there's two stickers to seal it. One on the front with their label of the series and one on the back with their Hit Parade silver label as well. Then in inside, and the hand numbered box. Inside, they've got this nice little share your hit cover with a nice little cushiony area for your card to be shipped. And then you end up with something like this. Vlad Guerrero Jr. Rookie Autograph from Bowman's Best Blue, numbered to 150, going to the Toronto Blue Jays and Corey Parson. There you go. That is 2019 Bowman's Best Baseball. Bowman's Best, year after year, one of my favorite products, always. Nice one for the Blue Jays to start. Box 99, next up. <laughs> right, Hank? Paging Sapphire. Paging Sapphire. Ooh. Not one, but three Hall of Fame autographs. Frank Robinson. Jim Palmer, Eddie Murray, 21 out of 27, tops triple threads. Dual jersey relic and a bat relic for the O's and Jeremy Rezer. That's beautiful. That is 20, 2009 tops triple threads. That's cool. Love it. Next box is box 35. Padres, Justin. Padres. Yeah, that was Padres Rockies. I did see that. And... How about Baltimore Orioles again? That is Bowman Platinum, 19 out of 25, die cut autograph of Manny Machado. Orioles, Jeremy Rezer. Cutting Edge Stars, that is from 2013, Bowman Platinum. Very cool. Look at the die cut on that. Very nice. Orioles off to an early lead. Box 28. Yeah, it was bad. It was bad. He also realized he had messed up as soon as he threw that punch. He was like, oh. Yeah, it was very, very dumb. Very, very dumb, and he deserves to go to jail for a night or two. Next up is Kyle Tucker. 
one of my un, one of my favorites, not spoken of a lot. Kyle Tucker rookie auto four out of four ninety nine refractor from Bowman Chrome. That's for the Houston Astros and Kurt Rose. That is 2019 Bowman Chrome. It's a nice looking card there. I mean, that's not enough. He still needs to face charges, too. 51. Each of them? Uh, Will, I think it's going to go tonight. I think we're like we're right at the halfway point. Ten spots were given away in fillers. So we've sold over twenty spots already. I think I think Transcendent's gonna go tonight. And remember this one if this isn't like the regular transcendent, this is Transcendent Hall of Fame. There's only fifty cases total. Only fifty. This regular transcendent has a hundred cases. This is only fifty, so even more limited. And we're going rookie auto for the Southsiders, Eloy Jimenez. Chicago White Sox, Victor Zamora. Very nice. Uh, that is 2019 Tops. It's the 1984 uh, Retro. What is this? Series 1? Series 1, maybe? Box 88. Yeah, no. I mean, it was pretty dumb, too. But yeah, the guy knew he messed up as soon as he did it. At least he didn't try to run like a little baby. He stood there. Let the fans jump him, and then sure, he faced some charges <laughs> quickly thereafter. As he should. I'd now like to see him get into a one-on-one -on -one fist fight with Dante Bichette. And I would like to see Bichette just bash the crap out of him. We're going Spencer Torkelson, 5 out of 19. Collegiate National Team Silhouettes. This works just like any of the team, any uh, card where it's a non-pro jersey, where it goes to either the team they're currently on or if they were retired or no longer playing, the team that they uh, played for the longest. Obviously, Spencer Torkelson being the number one overall pick to the Detroit Tigers. That's going to Jeremy Port, the Tigers, and last spot mojo. Very nice. Number one overall pick, Detroit Tigers, Spencer Torkelson. Box number three is up next. Remember, guys, second uh, second case of this is in the store now. Go get your spots. This one sold out real quick. I'm sure the next one will as well. And we've got a Topps Inception Alex Verdugo auto. 14 out of 50 for the Boston Red Sox and Steve Birch. That is 2021 Topps Inception Rookies and Emerging Stars Autograph. Traded from the Dodgers last year. Last Spot Mojo always works. Box 65 up next. We've got another patch auto, and it's a two-color patch auto Gavin Lux rookie from Immaculate Baseball, 41 out of 99 for the Dodgers and Corey Parson. Is he number 41 jersey number as well? Anybody know? Maybe jersey number hit? 
I know he just had uh, his first home run of the uh, of his career for the night. That was nice. There you go, Corey. And box number twelve. One box left after this, guys. But we've got a whole another ten boxes in the store. Random team number two. And we got Christian Pache. Pros or rookie auto, actually. Don Russ, 2021. Atlanta Braves, Oliver Soria. There you go, Oliver. And last but not least, box 40. Pache's back to the IL. Mm. 48 is good luck. Okay, so not 41. And our final auto is Rookie Gold Blake Snell. For, from Bowman Chrome. That is 19 out of 50. And that is 2016 Bowman Chrome. Going to the Braves and Wade Valentine. Nice gold auto there. Blake's now. And there you go, guys. That was the break. That was 2021 Hit Parade Baseball Limited Edition Series 15 Hobby 10 Box Case Break Random Team Number 1 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Sean, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for hanging out, and we'll see you next time.